Hey everybody, Spoon Red here, and as you can see, we're with Red Hat Enterprise Linux 6.2. So we're gonna install and upgrade a system. This is the big bad commercial available um, distro that's out there. So let's see how it holds up. Um, this is actually used as a server distro. So uh, now we're gonna skip because I know the media is all right. Oh God, Anaconda! I hate Anaconda. Oh, all right. Next. Next. Uh, next. Basic storage. Next. Uh, yes, discard any data. I don't know, that will be local. Next. Next. Root password. Uh, replace use all space. Right, change to disk. So um, here it says, what do we want to do? We can have a basic server, we can have a database server, a web server, identity management, virtualization host, just a normal desktop, software development workstation, or the minimal. Um, I'm not quite sure what I want to do with this one. Um, so let's boot it up as a just as a desktop so we'll do high availability and low balancing in there and resilience so we'll do all the packages uh, and we'll do the desktop I'm not gonna do customization of software uh, and normally you would choose any one of these other ones actually but For now, let's just boot it up as a desktop, as we can um, probably get be like get into s specialization after that point. So, but I have no idea. I've never booted this one up before. So, all right. As this is booting up the installation process, I'm going to uh, let it just run. And I'll be back with you guys when this is all done. Alright, so we've installed it. <clears throat> now let's reboot and see what it looks like. Oh well, we see red. So it's lived up to its name yet already. Alright, so you get a splash screen and then you still get the other ones to load. Okay, that's weird. Well, let's find out what it looks like. Come on. I am curious. Oh, we still have need to do this. I'm like, or yes, I agree. Um, no, but I don't need to connect to a Red Hat network server. Mm -hmm. So it's dumbest password ever, but okay. Um, yeah, go for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Oh wow. Well, 
Well, so far it looks decent. I mean, it's sluggish and slow as hell, but that's probably due to the fact that I'm doing something else at the moment as well. But this is it, basically. It's no different than any other distro I've ever seen, so. We have some special applications. Alright, so you can get everything via Red Hat server, I'm guessing. Yeah, you have to get everything via the Red Hat server, so you do everything through their server, which is a bit weird, but alright, no problem. So this is Red Hat Linux. Um, yeah, I'm not really too wowed by it actually. So that's it.